Uh, see, uh, uh, after every uh, success of every film, we are likely looking to uh, terms of can we continue this uh, uh, story. Uh, there will be obviously some interesting ideas, but what we see is you can do it is like, is this idea really compelling to make another film? If it is not, uh, financial benefits aside, we don't do that. We are very clear about it. Um, even with our initially we had some ideas, they were good but not great. So we left it aside, then suddenly uh, a few weeks back, my father, myself and my cousin, uh, the core uh, story team we were discussing and suddenly my cousin came up with a fantastic thought, an idea which I thought was, oh great, this, this has to be made. But uh, for a film to be made, there are many, many, many things that should uh, come together. The most important thing is the script. That's the first and foremost. But full script has to be done. Then we will look into different aspects of uh, when and how it can be made. But yes, at this point of time, I have a great idea, which I really think can come out as another after. <laughs> Yeah, it's a secret, guys. <laughs> okay, we got, we got time for. Um, I, 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 I'm taking this opportunity. I want to uh, make an appeal uh, to all the cinemas across America to give an intro for all yes. of us. <laughs> can go to a washroom and come. <laughs> uh, 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 second thing is like, during the process, uh, in India we see that, we see that a lot, people discuss the film. Yeah. In the first, they discuss the first half of the film, they will discuss what's the second half going to be. They have their own theories and they are invested in the film, which is, which is very good for the creator. And thirdly, your popcorn sales will go up. There is so many good things to happen. But, uh, for us Indians, uh, interval is a very, very integral part of uh, filmmaking. Uh, just like you have the three act structure, first act, second act, third act, uh, it is woven into the film. You might not notice it clearly, but it is woven into the film. The same way interval comes as a very clear indication mark for us. We usually make the audience like thinking, wow, what just happened kind of kind of moment. It might be a shock, it can be an emotional uh, moment, anything, but uh, yeah, that's how we try to write our stories. You talk about that being integral to Indian cinema, um, dancing and singing, that's also integral. Um, there's a lot of incredible songs in this film. And then there's not <laughs> Let's talk about that, my friend. Um, how? <laughs> I mean, it's it, it's unbelievable and, and, and irrelevable. The, the, the song, the lyrics, the performances, and, and just the, the overarching direction and the joy that that brings is something that we just don't see from a Western standpoint. You're just not seeing cinema anymore. So how did you put that thing together? And you shot this, this was, am I right? This was the last? Almost last, the almost last. And you uh, shot in the Ukraine? Ukraine, okay, yeah, yes. Yeah. In the presidential palace. Okay. The, um, uh, how, did you, how did you build this? And at what point, because you must have known, at what point did you know that you had lightning in a bottle and this was really special? The moment I had uh, Tarek and Sharon say yes uh, for the film, uh, I knew I, did, I had to have a, a dance sequence. That's what the audience are going going to expect, and that's what they want. And I had to uh, integrate it. But the funny thing about the story is, uh, the story writing is, the story doesn't care what the audience want. The story has its own. Dictation, uh, yeah, uh, uh, it dictates how it needs to uh, run. And the audience doesn't care for the story. The audience care for 
what we are getting uh, out of the screen. So as a director, I need to, I know the audience, audience want a, a beautiful dance number, but I have to integrate that into the, uh, into the film. And to make the things worse, I am talking about freedom fighters, I lose it, and then doing a, a massy dance number is, is not an easy thing to fit into the story. <laughs> <laughs> so in my mind, what I thought was, okay, they're not dancing. It is not a dance sequence. It is a fight. Yeah. That's, that's a competitive fight. So in my mind, that was it. And, and once I had that answer, it was easy to uh, get into it. But, but I mean, it's great music. It is great orchestration, it is great dancing, it is coordination of so many uh, people, uh, wonderful support from all the Ukrainian uh, group. The dancers were fantastic. They were not just dancing, they were acting. They were acting in, in many shots. You can you can see that all the dancers had wonderful expressions, body languages, everything. But if I have to give the credit to one person, I must say, it is the choreographer Prem Rakshit. Everyone to their bone, right? I mean, you have the yes. amount of steps to raise. You, you wouldn't believe. He composed more than 100 steps for that three signature moves for Nadu Nadu. Oh and he had four or five sets of assistants who were dancing, composing, dancing, and after 15, 20 steps, their legs were giving away. <laughs> they were taking away fresh set of assistants. <laughs> and believe me, a couple of the assistants were taken to the hospital because wow. their knees were popping. So, <laughs> so if you're ever invited to dance, and that's a song, the answer is no. <laughs> But, but the interesting thing is, is the steps are not complicated. A little bit of practice, anyone could do it. <laughs> anyone can do it. That's the reason why we see millions of millions of videos or views for the video where everyone, mother and daughter, two friends, father and son, brothers, everyone were dancing uh, for, that, for that step. Uh, because that's what we wanted. A little practice, everyone should be able to do it. Yeah. But they go so high. And, and it's, I mean, you're right. It, it's it's a it's a battle as fierce as, as anything else we see in the film. It's beautiful. Um, let's take some questions. <laughs>